Good morning, nine o'clock on Sunday morning. I'm off today and tomorrow. Blessing. I'm about to make coffee like usual. <laughs> I bought these when I was still living with my mom. These keto uh, pan pancake mix. You just add water. So I'm going to make this and bacon for breakfast for me and Julian. And <laughs> I don't know why he left this. He lost a tooth last night. if I can't get it to it's so weird it's crazy he's 10 he's still losing teeth that's weird to me I finished my coffee it's been about an hour um I was just Drinking my coffee, watching hoarders, and arguing on Facebook about the election. Typical Sunday morning activities. I'm gonna put some music on and start cleaning and cooking. I'm gonna clean up this mess in here because I didn't do my dishes last night after dinner. And then I'm gonna cook these pancakes and bacon. I got my, I'm gonna hook this up so I can listen to music while I clean. supposed to be one big one but it looks kind of regular like normal batter Much later on in the day, I don't even remember what I was doing when I left off last. I think cleaning, 
Anyway, as you can see, I've done some things. I got some pictures taken. I got a little bit of videos for some, you know, posts for the week. This took me all day because I took my time. I didn't set myself a time frame. I was just like, you know, take your time, enjoy it. I watched YouTube while I did my hair. Like I just was chilling. I put nails on. My hands are horrible. Like that is the result of working and having to put hand sanitizer on all the time. And I'm constantly banging my hand on something and they're just so dry that they just bust open. But I didn't use this hand for the, <laughs> for the nail post, but these are the nails. So cute. Hair came out really good again. I really, really, really want to get a sew in because it is just like, it got longer. I really want to sew in because look how long my, like my front pieces are. Like they're super long. Like that's, you know? So like if it's just this amount of hair out, like that's a good length to have out. And then, you know, it'll blend really nice with some layers in the in the bundled hair you know there's this girl on instagram her name is um antoinette um and her page is in antoinette's chair and she does the most bomb installs and she's in brooklyn and new york is only like three hours from here so but her December books aren't open yet. And I was like, that would be a, like a bomb ass birthday present for myself is like to get this install. Cause she specializes in doing like seamless install, but that's like her specialty and like preserving your hair and like, you know, natural hair. Like all the girls are natural. They just have leave out, you know? So I would love to go to her. She's, <laughs> I don't want to say it's pricey. like. I'll leave her website. You go take a look for yourself and come back and comment what you think. I think it's pretty reasonable because she includes the hair and like the full service. Like she's, I mean, braid down all of that. So like, that's a lot of work. Like that's not, you know, sew-ins are not easy. You know, I mean, the sewing part, I feel like is probably the easiest part for the stylist. As somebody who went to cosmetology school, I was taught how to do sew-ins. And the braiding is the hardest and the most tedious. That's that's the key to how your install is gonna look. And if she specializes in flat, natural, seamless installs, then her braid pattern is probably something specific or, you know, they're super flat or super thin, I don't know. But, you know, it, it combine that with the fact that the hair is included in the price and the hair looks bomb, like it looks like it's really good quality. I think the price is, is pretty reasonable. I mean, I know people who bought wigs for more than what she's charging for this full service, you know? And if you've got the hair for it, if you've got the length, then you can match, you know, you can blend your hair, why not? So, even if I can't go to her, I wanna get it done. Like, I do know a few people that do, um, that do installs, so, you know. I could definitely make it happen for my birthday either way. I'm gonna go eat because I'm starving and like I have a headache. Good morning. It's Monday morning. I just got back. I got up, took Julian to school because I had to get, um, I had to go to the bank. So I was like, I might as well just get up with him. Like I'm already up, you know. Now I'm back home. I just made coffee. Duh. I have this mess to address right now. Well, I'm gonna drink my coffee and then I'm gonna start folding that. That's all clean, but I never put it away. So it was just sitting there in the bag. And then yesterday I had to film, like I took some pictures and stuff and I had to move it out the way. So I shoved it in the closet. <clears throat> and if I leave it in the closet, I will never do it. So I brought it out and put it here in front of my face, you know? <laughs> oh, I got this different detox and soothe two-step treatment mask. So I've been hearing a lot about this different uh, line. They must have just dropped this because I've heard of different gel before, but I thought it was just for acne. Like I didn't know it was for like any kind, I mean, you know, any problem skin. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this different mask. So it comes with a little spatula.
I set a timer for three minutes. My timer just went off and scared the shit out of me. Time to rinse. <laughs> actually on my way out the door I am so this is my makeup for the day I always I like to see it in the sunlight because them LED or little like vanity lights they're not the same so it came out pretty good this is my outfit for the day I'm heading out now. I'm going to meet a friend that um, actually I haven't seen or spoken to this person since before. I mean, since after I left my husband, after I like left him for good, I haven't spoken to this person or seen them. Um, so I'm pretty excited to reconnect something quick to eat just catch up for a little bit so i'm on my way now i need to step up my sunglasses game because all of my glasses are busted like just busted my one pair that were like my favorite my sacred holy grail pair were the um the high keys by desi with um that key australia quay i don't know how you say it but but they got beat up and toe up from the flow up because i let other people wear them and shit and, you know nobody gonna take care of your shit the way you do so anyway it's gonna take me about 40 minutes to get here get to my friend's house so I'm going to turn on my music. Hopefully the sun's gonna get out my face. 